Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am doing something a little bit different today. I am going to show you guys how I uh, plan out my CVS shopping trips for the week. And so this uh, shopping trip is going to be for the week of February the 23rd. Um, so we are going to plan out our weeks. I'm going to turn the camera. I'm going to show you the paper that I use. Um, I usually do this on my computer, but I'm going to show you guys on paper uh, and actually write it out. And I'm going to show you how I plan my trips and kind of my thought process with goals behind what deals I do and don't do. So let's go ahead. Let's jump behind the scenes and let's start planning those deals for next week. All right, guys. So we are behind the scenes here. This is my uh, paper that I use to uh, plan all of my deals. I hope that you guys can see this um, okay. So we're going to write on here everything that I'm going to get. I'm thinking that I'm going to do two deals this week. I'm going to do the Pepto-Bismol deal and I'm going to do the Spend 20 Get 5. All the other deals that I wanted to do, they just don't quite work out for me uh, this week. So as of right now, we're just doing two deals. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first deal is going to be the Pepto Bismol. So we're going to buy two and I put the two and I circled it. So I know that's the, how many I'm going to get. And Pepto, if my handwriting is funky, please forgive me. I'm kind of in a weird, uh, position and they are four seventy nine, and four seventy nine times two is nine dollars and fifty eight cent. Okay, and then um, we have coupons. So we're gonna have two fifty cent off of one manufacturer's coupon that's gonna come in our PNG. So I'm gonna write two, and I'm gonna write point five zero off of one. And I'm just going to write Pepto. And I usually put um, where it came from. And I won't be able to do that for everything because I didn't like beforehand think about that. Like where the coupons would have come from. So after coupons, that's $6.58. And then I'm going to... So let me kind of go back. So this is the items with price. So this is the Pepto-Bismol and with the price, this is the total before coupon. So I'm getting two of these. So I add these two up and I get $9.48. The coupons that I'm going to use, I write that here. The totals after coupon is what I wrote here, $6.58. The ECB here is if I'm going to use any extra bucks to help lower my out-of-pocket. And I'm going to use a $5 extra buck. That's going to make my total a dollar and 58 cent plus tax and extra bucks is five dollars. So extra bucks to receive is how many extra bucks I'm going to receive for this deal, which is five dollars. So I think that's a pretty stinking deal before um, extra bucks that I use is just six dollars. So um that's not that bad of a difference. And I'm only using a $5 extra buck and I'm getting a $5 extra buck back. Um, as opposed to the next deal I'm going to do, I'm going to spend way more in extra bucks and I'm only going to get back a small uh, amount in extra bucks. So let's go ahead and let's write what we're going to get in this one. And I have to kind of go look because I didn't write it down. So we're going to do everything together on this one. So we're going to buy four palm olives. At $1.99. We're going to buy two Tide at five ninety-five, And we're going to buy one Dawn at 99 cent. Now I do know that gives me a total of $20.83. Okay, so the coupons that we're going to use is we're going to use or we are going to use four 
50 cent off of one palm olive. We're going to use two, two dollar off of one tie. And then that's it. The Don has no coupons. So after coupons, it's going to give me a total of $14.83. And for this transaction right here, I think I'm going to use uh, $14 in extra bucks. So that leaves me with a total of 83 cent and I'm gonna get back a $5 extra buck. So the only thing that I don't like about the spin deals and I do them because they have great items in the spin deals um, is that you spend a lot, you have to spend a lot uh, out of pocket in order to get a very small reward. But like I said, you get really good items with um, the spin deals. And so with this spin deal, there are other things. There's the Scott uh, paper towels. And this is not a for sure thing. I may change my mind because the first paper that I looked at, there was no price on the Scott paper towels. But I was assuming that they would be $5.49 because they use the oil when they're part of the promo. And so I'm looking at a fresh um, paper and it's showing me that the Scott paper towels are $5.49. So I'm not for sure if I'm going to do that deal. And I think that I might do that deal because I have two $1 off of one printable coupons um, for the Scott paper towels. So I may do that. But as of right now, this is everything that I have. And so I'm going to receive back $10 in extra bucks. I don't have anywhere really to write it. Um, to say like what my grand total is, but I do know that this is what um, I have and what I'm going to be uh, getting back is $10. So I'm spending $19 in extra bucks and getting back 10, so I'm losing $9. Um, I think it's a fair trade, um, just considering the things that I'm gonna get. But like I said, this spend deal may change for me, but as of right now, this is what I'm going to get. I hope that this video was helpful for you guys. If y'all have any questions about any of the deals that I'm going to do uh, next week, go ahead and drop them in the comments down below. And guys, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up to subscribe and hit the bell notification because I don't want you to miss any videos. If you guys like this type of video, I will do more of these videos. And as always, guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye.